Good evening. I hope you've had a lovely day and I hope that the new year for you is going amazingly. So last week I did a video called Making Them New Year Words Count. And I said after I did that video that I would make a series of videos to follow on, follow on from that. The last one I did was money and talking about how you could achieve the things you wanted by making little savings in a variety of different ways. This week I'm going to talk about career. About how you can get that career that you want in your life. How to go about it, what you need to do, what steps you need to take. So let's begin. What is it that you want to do? You need to ask yourself that out loudly. What is it that I want to do in my life? Winston Churchill said, find a job you love and you'll never work a day in your life. And to me, that's what it's supposed to be about. It's about doing something that doesn't feel like a job. Something that you absolutely love doing every single day. Something that makes you happy. That you look forward to doing. So here is a few things to get you on that path of getting that career that you want. Do some research. What are the requirements? Is it possible that maybe some of the existing qualifications that you've got can be used to get into a new career path? And the experience you've got? Many of the things that we do in our everyday jobs, the experience we get, can be then passed on to another um, career known as transferable skills. We have online resources. So look online about what we you know, what exactly what is involved in the career that you want to do and the requirements. And look for opportunities. Many employers now have sort of work experience placements where they'd be happy for you to go in and do some sort of two week, you know, or a month placement or maybe even longer. So you can experience what it's like doing what you want to do. Which will be a very good way to make you make that final help you make that final decision if you want to go forward and become whatever it is you want to a doctor, a solicitor, a nursery nurse, a nurse, whatever it is that you want to do. Speak to people. Never underestimate the amount of context you can make. You know, it might be possible that one of your friends knows someone who who does what you want to do. And they are the people you need to speak to because they will be able to answer all your questions. Don't get caught up in limiting beliefs. You see, many people are like, I won't be no good at college. I won't be no good at school. going back into education. I failed all my GCSEs. I was thick at school, you know. Limiting, limiting, limiting. Limiting beliefs will get you nowhere. You need to be confident and positive that you want to, if you if you want to achieve something, to have that confidence, that determination, that, that motivation, that you can achieve anything you want. Anything you want. So don't have limiting beliefs. When you was at school was a different time, you know. Since then you're all grown up, you've had life experiences, you're more aware of things. So what how you did at school, you know, or in your teens or in your twenties is not how you're going to do now because you've got a different mindset or you will be on the path to getting a better mindset so that you can achieve whatever it is in life that you want. It's very important to believe in yourself and be confident and just believe that you can achieve anything you want because there's only one person responsible in this world for making you a success and that's you. No one else can do it. People can give you hundreds of reasons why you should go for something that you want to do. But ultimately, if you don't want to do it or you don't believe in it, that you can do it, they might as well be talking to a wall. So it all really, in the end, comes down to you. Imagine yourself doing your career. Really visualise. Do some meditation. Relax in the bath. And really visualise yourself doing it that will keep you on that path all fired up and motivated to go for that career. You know when you were little and someone said to you, what do you want to do when you're all grown up? And you'd say, I want to be an astronaut or a photographer or a doctor or a midwife or a nurse. 
or a, a wildlife discoverer. I want you to get some of that magic pack. Get some of that magic pack and, you know, so you can be like, you know what? I'm going to do this. I'm going to become a nurse. I've always thought I'd make a good nurse. I'm going to become a nurse. Or I'm going to become a photographer. Or I'm going to become an architect. I'm going to do this. You know what? I can do it. And I will do it. I will achieve this. And then just start. And I'll tell you something, honestly. When you open the world, view the, view the, when you view the world through different with a different mindset, it's a different world. It's a different world full of possibilities and new friends and contacts and opportunities. It's a totally different world and it's so, so exciting. Getting up every day, going to work, doing something that you love. You know, I've become a speaker because this is not a job to me. This is me, it's my passion and it's my life and I love it. I love the impact to make. I can love that I can inspire people to live life on their terms every single day. And would I change it? Not on your Nelly. <laughs> Keep yourself motivated. Keep that belief in there that you're going to do it. Every day, take little steps. You know, keep doing your research. Keep speaking to people. Keep developing as a person. And get that life that you want. So I hope you found this useful. Just a few little tips. You know, we're on a brand new year, right? And so many people, and then the start of the, the year, say, what are you going to do? Well, I'm, and I was one of them. I was one of them. I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that. And by the end of the year, I did none of it. You know, don't become like, don't be, be like that. And now if I say I'm going to do something, I'm going to do it. Because I've got a different mindset. You want to live one life. Tomorrow is never promised, right? You need to, you only live one life and be so grateful and have true gratitude that you have life. Because someone would give anything to get what you've got. So that when you get to the end, you can say, you know what? Boom. It's been a blast. It's been fun. I've had an amazing career doing something that I loved. And it's been so much fun. I've got, I've made so many friends that I consider like family. I've visited places. You know, the experience and knowledge I've gained. Make your life matter and live it on purpose every single day. Anyway, I thank you so much for watching my video. Please give it a like. And subscribe to our channel because it's amazing and the value you get in these videos are amazing, life-changing videos that will change your mindset and change your life. I thank you. Goodbye.